When Tesla owners see this warning message, it indicates a significant change in their vehicle's charging behavior. The battery management system has activated protective measures. The maximum battery charge level reduced warning means your Tesla's battery management system has detected conditions requiring a limit on maximum charge capacity to protect battery longevity. To understand this warning, we need to examine the Tesla battery system components. The battery management system monitors and controls the entire battery pack. Several factors can trigger this warning. The most common cause is natural battery degradation. Lithium ion batteries naturally lose capacity over time and charge cycles. Battery capacity typically decreases from 100% to around 93% after seven years of use. Thermal management issues are another major cause. Overheating during charging or coolant system malfunctions can trigger the warning as a protective measure. Cell imbalance occurs when individual battery cells charge and discharge unevenly. Software or firmware issues in the battery management system can also trigger false warnings. As of 2025, this warning is most common in older Tesla Model S and Model X vehicles from 2012 to 2016, affecting approximately 15 to 20% of these vehicles. However, it can occur in any Tesla model under specific conditions. When you encounter the maximum battery charge level reduced warning, there are several immediate actions you can take to address the issue. First, reduce your charging speed by using slower AC charging instead of supercharging. This graph shows how charging speeds vary between different charger types. Lower your daily charge limit to 70 to 80% and avoid charging in extreme temperatures. Allow your car to sit plugged in for extended periods to enable battery conditioning. Battery conditioning is crucial for maintaining optimal performance. This process helps balance individual cells and manage thermal conditions. If these immediate actions don't resolve the warning, professional diagnostics are the next step. Tesla service centers can perform comprehensive diagnostics using specialized equipment. This includes battery health assessments to check individual cell performance. They also inspect the thermal management system, checking coolant levels, pump operation, and temperature sensors throughout the cooling circuit. Finally, technicians can recalibrate the battery management system software to ensure accurate readings and optimal performance. When diagnostics reveal hardware issues, several repair options are available. For severely degraded battery modules, replacement may be necessary. This Tesla module shows the complex arrangement of individual cells that may need replacement. Cooling system repairs are often more affordable, involving pump replacement, coolant flushes, or line repairs to restore proper thermal management. High voltage components like contactors and fuses may also require replacement to restore full charging capability. Tesla has also implemented several solutions to address these issues proactively. Tesla regularly releases over-the-air software updates that improve battery management system accuracy and thermal management algorithms. Extended warranty programs now cover many battery-related issues, particularly for older Model S and Model X vehicles from 2012 to 2016. Tesla has also updated diagnostic procedures for service centers enabling more accurate identification and resolution of battery issues. Remember, early intervention and proper maintenance are crucial for minimizing the impact of the maximum battery charge level reduced warning. Following these troubleshooting steps can help restore your Tesla's full charging capability.